In this tutorial in Cyberlink Card Director, we're going to show you how to change the face of fonts in order to create emphasis in your production. I have a production here that advises people not to text and drive, and if I play the clip, it will give me the opportunity to just watch it go down the road with my three recommendations. Now what I'd like to do in, in this case, in the clip, I press my home key, is I'd like to make it so that I use a little color on these particular elements in order to make a difference. So let's, let's go ahead and begin that process. I want all three items to appear on the screen for about a minute. So I'll take my time indicator and move it over and just for about one second. And then I'm going to right click and I'm going to split or I can use control key split this. So when it starts out, all the three will be white in color. Then I'm going to go and let's say I want to change it for two more seconds. So we'll go up to my uh, three second mark here. Okay, and then I will split this again, control T. And then let's do another one at five seconds into the project. And do control T. Okay. Now I've split it. Well, here's what I'd like to do. We start out with where all of them are white. I click on my copy in the middle here. I'll double click on it. I'll get to my title designer. Okay, now with my title designer, I want to highlight the first item. And let's say we want to change the uh, color of the entire item there, the sentence. We have my font here, we have my font face. Let's see, let's change it to bright yellow. Oh, let's change it to orange. That's a little more bold. I'll click on OK. OK, and now I've got You Can Enjoy the Road. I'll save that. And then I'll go to the next one, double click on it. And on this case, I want to take the second item uh, about living in the moment, highlight it, can select all the characters. And then I want this one. And save that. And then I'll click on my third one. I'll go two more two more seconds into it. Right there, we'll split it again. And take this one here, double click on it. And now with the third item selected, we'll highlight it. Do our orange again and save it. And so now what I have, it looks like I almost keyframed the text. We could have some narration under it, whatever we like. I'll click and play. You can enjoy the road. You live in the moment. You help keep others safe. And then it pops here. And then I could actually take this one and uh, take uh, these items here, do some editing and change all of them to maybe a different color. Let's, let's make, just for fun, let's make that uh, a uh, dark green. This one too, and the third one. And we'll pick it again. Uh, we could also change the shadow um, for fun. We could uh, take the uh, border and turn it from blue, let's turn it to white. Oops, I need to highlight it first. Uh, go to white, a white border. Okay, I'll click OK. Yeah, that's better. And I'll modify the two, I'll pause it first. And now I've changed the border. So the entire effect when we're looking here, we go from the second to the third, and that turns color, and then at the end, 
they all turn this way. That's one way in which you can change your font color in order to show emphasis in your projects in CyberLink PowerDirector. Mm -hmm.